Hello everyone, today I'm going to do my predictions for the Royal Rumble, which is on tomorrow. It's my favourite pay-per-view of the year as well. So, yeah, let's get started. So, first, they haven't announced a pre-show match, so I don't know what's happening on there, but I think one of the matches that is on the card probably is going to get shifted to there. So, we'll start with that, and I think it one of the matches that's even going to be on the pre-show is the US title match, which is Humberto Carrillo versus Andrade. And I'm just going to go with Andrade to retain the belt. And the other match I think that might be on the pre-show maybe is Shorty G versus Sheamus. So Sheamus has been out for months injured and this is going to be his first match back. So... I expect Sheamus to win that against Shorty G as well. So, yeah, those are my predictions for pre-show match, probably. If not, they'll announce something else, maybe. Anyway, next we've got the SmackDown Women's Championship match. Bailey defending against Lacey Evans. And I think Bailey's going to retain the belt. Um... Yeah, another prediction that I'm going to make. I don't think any champions are losing their belts. So, <laughs> for the Raw Women's Championship with ba Becky Lynch versus Asuka, again, I think Becky's going to win. She'll finally get that win over Asuka that she been, hasn't been able to get. So, she'll finally beat her. And next, we have... A Falls Count Anywhere match, which is King Baron Corbin versus Roman Reigns. And they've been feuding for quite a while now. So hopefully this might be the last match in their feud. And I'm going to pick Roman Reigns to win that. So now for the, univer yeah, the Universal Championship. Daniel Bryan versus The Fiend Bray Wyatt in a strap match. So, <laughs> yeah, that's going to be interesting. I don't know why Daniel Bryan would want to be strapped to The Fiend, but I think that Bray will retain the belt there too. And I think everyone that's currently the champion, they're probably going to stay champion until at least WrestleMania or around WrestleMania. I, can't, I don't really see anyone losing their belt until then. So next... I think that was all the matches. So now we've got the two Royal Rumble matches. So first, the men's Royal Rumble match. And that one, I think Drew McIntyre is going to win. At least I would like him to. Um, so he's my pick. And Brock Lesnar's entering at number one. Trying to prove that he can beat 30 men in the Royal Rumble, I guess. So... We'll see if he can or not. I don't think he will because he's not my pick. My pick is Drew McIntyre. So, finally, for the, the Women's Royal Rumble match, um, this might be an unpopular pick, but I think Charlotte Flair is going to win the Women's Royal Rumble. Um, I don't really know why, but I guess you kind of can't have Wrestlemania without the Queen and she kind of has had big matches at Wrestlemania so I guess that's my reason why I pick Charlotte and yeah that's it um we'll see what else gets added and if there's going to be any surprises in the Royal Rumble usually there is like surprise entries and stuff so that'll be good and there's probably going to be a few returns as well, like a few, um, at least for the Women's Rumble, I've heard that, like, um, Nia Jax and Naomi and Ruby Riot are all meant to be returning, apparently, so I guess we'll see if they do. That'll be good to see them back after being injured for a while, all of them. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, and if you want to predict who you think is going to win the Royal Rumble, leave a comment below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!